someone despises me. That's their problem. Realize that you have something in you more powerful and miraculous than the things that affect you and make you dance like a puppet. No carelessness in my actions, no confusion in my words, no imprecision in my thoughts. No matter what anyone says or does, my task is to be good. If it's endurable, then endure it. Stop complaining. Not to be driven this way and that, but always to behave with justice and see things as they are. Not to assume it's impossible because you find it hard, but to recognize that if it's humanly possible, you can do it too. Do not let others hold you back. The object of life is not to be on the side of the majority, but to escape finding oneself in the ranks of insane. Today I escaped anxiety, or no, I discarded it because it was within me, in my own perceptions, not outside. There is nowhere that a person can find a more peaceful and trouble-free retreat than in his own mind. So constantly give yourself this retreat and renew yourself. True good fortune is what you make for yourself. Good fortune, good character, good intentions, and good actions. Anywhere I can lead your life, I can lead a good one. When I do help others, or help them to do something. I'm doing what I was designed for. Think about the expanse of time and how brief, almost momentary, the part marked for you. Think of the workings of fate and how infinitesimal your role is. The responsibility is all mine. No one can stop me from being honest or straightforward. To love only what happens, no greater harmony. The happiness of my life depends upon the quality of my thoughts. It is not death that a man should fear, but he should fear never beginning to live. There is a limit to the time assigned you, and if you don't use it to free yourself, it will be gone and never return. Limit yourself to the present. The first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are. Never esteem anything as of advantage to you that will make you break your word or lose your self-respect. Receive without pride let go without attachment. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. 
Be tolerant with others and strict with yourself. Get busy with life's purpose. Toss aside empty hopes and get active in your own rescue. Everything is born from change. Stop allowing your mind to be a slave, to be jerked about by selfish impulses, to kick against fate and the present, and to mistrust the future. Waste no more time arguing about what a good man should be. Be one. Think of yourself as dead. You have lived your life. Now take what's left and live it properly. Learn to be indifferent to what makes no difference. The struggle is great, the task divine to gain mastery, freedom, happiness, and tranquility. It's courtesy and kindness that define me. There is never any need to get worked up or to trouble your soul about things you can't control. These things are not asking to be judged by you. Leave them alone. Why should you feel anger at the world? as if the world would notice. Be like the cliff against which the waves continually break, but it stands firm and tames the fury of the water around it. If it is not right, do not do it. If it is not true, do not say it. If you are distressed by anything external, the pain is not due to the thing itself, but to your estimate of it. And this you have the power to revoke at any moment. Ask yourself at every moment, is this necessary? Your days are numbered. Use them to throw open the windows of your soul to the sun. If you do not, the sun will soon set, and you with it. The best revenge is not to be like your enemy. Do not indulge in dreams of having what you have not, but reckon up the chief of the blessings you do possess, and then thankfully remember how you would crave for them if they were not yours. The things you think about determine the quality of your mind. Your soul takes on the color of your thoughts. Because a thing seems difficult for you, do not think it impossible for anyone to accomplish. Never remind people about yourself because those who value you, remember, and the rest doesn't matter. Choose not to be harmed, and you won't feel harmed. Don't feel harmed, and you haven't been. Do not act as if you were going to live 10,000 years. Death hangs over you while you live, while it is in your power. Be good. Here is a rule to remember in the future 
when anything tempts you to feel bitter. Not, this is misfortune, but to bear this worthily is good fortune. When you arise in the morning, think of what a privilege it is to be alive, to think, to enjoy, to love.